Oh, what are you looking for, little kitty? White hole. Oh, you mean black hole. No, white hole. Well, before you start looking for a white hole in the universe, there are a few things you need to know about them. What? Let me explain. Hey friends, so in today's episode, let us explore this scientific fantasy by answering a fantastic question. What are white holes? Zoom in! Albert Einstein first predicted the existence of black holes in 1916 with his maths equation famously known as the general theory of relativity. Now, more than a hundred years later, scientists have managed to find its evidence in the universe by observing its impact on the surrounding area as the black hole's powerful gravity pulls them towards it. And finally, in 2019, the International Event Horizon Telescope managed to capture an image of a black hole, giving us solid proof of their existence. This historical discovery has made the scientific community ponder the possibilities of another cosmic phenomenon known as the White Holes. Now, what in the universe are they? Well, for someone watching a white hole from a distance, it might appear to them just like a black hole with a mass and a ring of dust and gas around the event horizon. But functionally, they are the mathematical opposite of black holes. Meaning, instead of pulling objects towards it, a white hole spews things out of it. And for that reason, these cosmic objects are famously known as the black hole's neglected twin. But unlike black holes, there's no evidence about white holes' existence and formation. All we have is a mathematical equation and a few theories based on it. One such theory often mentioned is in the context of wormholes in which a black hole acts as the entry point to a tunnel through space and time, ending in a white hole somewhere else in the universe. But this concept is highly controversial because, according to Einstein's theory, the point of singularity at the center of black holes would prevent anything from passing through to the white hole on the other side which made the quantum scientists wonder then what happens to the things that enter the black hole. So, some of them came up with an alternative theory that says a white hole is actually the result of death of a black hole. Yes, according to this theory, when a black hole dies, it may become as small as a microgram in size and would no longer obey the laws of physics. Due to its tiny size, it won't have gravity, and at the same time, its interior will contain everything it swallowed during its lifetime as a living black hole. And after a while, it will start to spit out these objects, one after the other, or with a bang. This theory gave room to plenty of imagination and few scientists compared this behavior of white holes with the concept of the Big Bang Theory. Yes, the burst of energy and matter released from the Big Bang responsible for creating our universe looks incredibly similar to how white holes work. But again, we don't have any concrete evidence of it and all we have for now is a mathematical equation and a few theories. But hopefully someday, someone from you could decide to explore this mysterious subject and come up with an exact answer to the question, what exactly is a white hole? And hopefully, we will make a video on your achievement. So, good luck with your research, future scientists, and keep us updated about your work. Trivia time!
Did you know that the concept of existence of white holes was introduced in 1964 by Dmitry Yevich Novikov? And in 2006, there was a gamma ray burst called 060614. that lasted for 102 seconds some scientists believe that it was a white hole hope you learned something exciting today until next time it's me dr binox zooming out equation solved <laughs> never mind